I have no idea why the fuck I'm doing this right now. What is merely possessing me to want to play this. But, I'm curious. Curiosity killed the cat, dude. Yeah, well, it's killing me on the inside, so I realize this now. Oh, how bad can this be? Well, there's only one way to find out. I'm in Troll Land! What? Some of these are crap. I don't think so. Do I smell some enemies always respawn action going on tonight? Joel McCool, you are obsessed with that quest. What the, what the... Huh? What did I get killed by? Well, I was only on half a heart left, so it must have been something... ...weak, I guess. So money is arrows, apparently. If you slash the grass and walk over it, you die. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I only played this out of curiosity. And given what I've seen so far, I'm starting to highly doubt I'm going to beat this. But I don't know if I even want to even get to the first level at this rate. So basically, don't slash the grass. Level 1 area. Oh, hey, look at those four heart spikes everywhere. They look so wonderful. Bet you have no idea how wonderful they look, because they just look simply wonderful. All there and deadly and stuff like that. And I have no words that can describe how stupid this is. I missed the cave. Oh god. Oh god. What? This is not right at all. What? What the fuck? What the fuck just happened? 
happened? <sighs> and suddenly, the spikes cover the screen and I die. Was there like a time limit for that screen? Oh, by the way, if you don't get to that screen fast enough, you die. The end. <sighs> now this is a real Halloween horror quest. Cause I feel sorry for the sad saps to try to play this quest. Other than me, of course. Oh, so much for having a sword beam. Oh, piss off! God damn it! I hate these guys! It's like, what, you wanted to kill me? Well, too bad, you can't kill me. Well, I don't know how long I'm gonna play this. I don't know how long my sanity will stay intact. I'm only seven minutes in. And this is bad. <laughs> The sword beam has half damage, that's good to know. Heart container there. I have to get that. Oh fuck, I'm gonna always respawn. Totally a good idea, right guys? Enemies always respawn is always a good idea. Oh, good grief. Just gonna go through here carefully. Now people are probably wondering why do I actually play this shit? And I respond with the simple I don't know. What? What? I got killed by absolutely nothing. Again. Are you bloody kidding me? <laughs> yeah, I realize this, but this, this is... This is a troll quest, and when I say it, I, I use the term troll lightly. This quest is bad. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to go back through here again. Okay, the other screen's a troll screen. Don't go that way. I get the feeling I need more health, or a candle, or something other than where I am now. Well, that's supposedly level one, but you know, invisible spikes. Who would have ever thought of something like that before? No, don't bother opening it up in Sequest. Just save your sanity from looking at this disaster, please. I don't know how long I'm even gonna play this. Swamp Eddie. I feel sorry for Eddie about now because holy crap, this quest is. I drowned. Holy crap, this quest is terrible. God freaking damn it. Oh, 
All side of me is always respond. <laughs> yeah, I love that quest pool, don't ya? Using it all the time. Why, thank you for calling me an idiot. I feel greatly appreciative of your idiot callingness. This is the two square temple. What? Fuck, I screwed that up. Did all that for no reason at all. I got ashes. I feel like I feel like stabbing my eyes out with a fork. These guys always drop bombs now. Kind of look like that. Maybe it's such a lied. What we've got in here. I know what I gotta do now. Die. Get more bombs. Yeah, I realized that. I realized that already quite a bit. There's no point to this, is there? I just got an extra key and I'm gonna die. <sighs> this quest is fascinating. This quest is just fascinating. Well, this is a bomb wall down at the bottom of this thing, too. Oh yeah, I take no bomb damage, that's nice to know. Unless I gotta do what I think I gotta do. Nope, I don't gotta do what I think I gotta do. So I gotta bomb that wall. That could be another possibility. I don't know. I'm just making random guesses at this point. Okay, that's not what I gotta do. But I'll die anyways. Yeah, 
Yep, just a random key. Nothing here to see but a... Oh, hey, block push. Oh. I went up and came down here. Fun. And when I say fun, I mean, uh, no, it does not look fun at all. Oh no, trial and error sounds like a good idea, or getting there with full health so I can break in. That might be a better idea. Oh, I think we found the real definition of scary sword now. Because that sword is quite deadly. This is a shitty quest. I play these so you don't have to. Do not play this at home. We do these so you don't have to. Do not try this at home. Well, it's obviously not by doing that. <laughs> it's amazing you never pass for this quest. As enemies always set to return, and I can name a lot of other things, but you know, we'd be beating a dead horse by then. Yep, this is dumb. The Four Temple. Oh. Fuck you. Alright, those are spikes. Now I know. Fuck you! Oh, fuck you too! Oh, you 
are kidding me. You gotta use this pile of dust. In other words, you might be going the wrong way. I don't give a crap. Go back to the start. Spikes there. Spikes on my right and left. How much health does this thing have? Thank God he left Sword Beam on. Does this have more health than Bagel's first Aquamentus did? Jesus! That's a lot of health! Five dollars says I can't push that. Oh yeah, that's right, uh... Sorbio does half damage. The sword beam is in fact nerfed. I do remember that now. He nerfed it. He nerfed the wooden sword beam to do half damage. Oh, this is just so wrong. Thank you. A troll face. I killed a troll face! I don't feel any better than I did before. Yeah, I figured so. I took a big stab, because there's no way you're gonna push those blocks to anywhere. Those were dead ends, you. So many maps. You can never have too many maps, guys. Better grab everything I can. It's the Blue Boria Disco Room of Disco Insanity. Oh hey, a walk through a block. Who would have guessed? Um, welcome to Disco Fever. I don't even know anymore. Oh, it is. I'm invincible now. Oh, so these reset the enemies. And my clock as well. <laughs> Love this game. Love it a lot. I am being so sarcastic you have no idea. If I'm gonna go left in this room, you, um, just go to that one room over there. But when I say love, I, I really don't love it. I really find this quite stupid. <laughs> Welcome to the Hall of Disco.
Yes, yeah, so those are in fact TV screens on the floor. You have entered the disco realm. Realm of the Disco King. I got a rupee! Woo! You have no idea how I'm excited right now. I got a freaking rupee! The dude gave me a rupee. Like, I'm so blessed. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. Yeah, it's definitely worth the fourth day. What are you kidding? This is the worst piece of shit I've touched. Liberation of Hyrule was better. Second. Why is that block dark? There's probably no reason, it's just dark for no reason at all. Oh, you are fucking kidding me. It's just there to be there, basically. Nothing I quite like to do on a Monday early morning to play a very bad quest. because this makes a lot of sense. WHAT?! And I knocked stuff off my drawer, thank Ah! Ugh, making a mess. Ugh. Ugh. to the bat robe room at the sprite. Reset my spawn. Room of the disco. I'm 
Here now, got a clock. Uh, we gotta do this shit again. Probably don't, but I'm doing it anyways. <laughs> Nothing in the fire room. Good. Well, let's hightail it to here, get the key, get the hell out of here. Right, so I do not have to worry about that. I hope so. I'm just gonna move on, beat the boss up, and get the hell out of fuck, get the hell out of this place. A heart container, maybe? Like if it's a heart container, then by all means, I kind of need to stop doing that. So. Oh, a heart? That's heartless. It gives you a heart. Oh, great. Let me reset my spawn. By killing you again. a little creative. That was actually amazingly easy. Oh, it's a views ball, right? Oh boy. <laughs> Don't think so. I was like making sure that's not boomerangable, because this quest is bad. I'm right, assuming I go to the forest over here and be as careful as hell, because I already know what happens when you slash grass tiles. It's not fun, believe me. What happens? You die. That's what happens. Surprise? No? Well, oh well. Empty swamp over here. Do oh, I'll go over there later then. Are we seriously doing this shit again? Okay. Let's go to the swamp. Good idea. <laughs> I like good ideas like that. I like good ideas like that too. And this. But not that blue thing. The blue curvy thing can go to hell.
diagonal walk. That is dumb. Take my ruby, please. Diagonal walking, yeah. Only in 2.5 would you be required to do something so stupid. Only in bad 2.5 stuff. <laughs> Let's leave the good stuff out of this. <laughs> Lots of jump scares. And whoa! Disco. There's no disco music, by the way. I have found the disco. Do not fart at the. Do not. Do not fart at the disco. No farting at the disco dudes. What the fuck? What is that? Is oh, whatever he is, he's not friendly. What the hell with this place? I want a better sword. Blood. I am regretting that magic shield now. Oh, hey, I got through. I can see. Ow. Hey, you screw up, you fall right back to start. I hate my life. <laughs> Better save in case I use the super bomb incorrectly because that can happen in this quest. No, go away. I don't, the last thing I need is you bothering me. <laughs> Stupid pop up. Huh? Okay, so you can't walk on those lily paths, but you can walk on all the others. Thank you, game, for making a lot of sense today. Okay, that's not gonna be a rough path then. Oh, yeah, that's the wrong way. I like the whole, you know, some only pads you can walk on, some you can't. It adds challenge to this whole thing. I'm being sarcastic, by the way, this is terrible.
It's like saying, yes, I like lacing my quest with cyanide. I'm sure everyone else will enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, no, don't do this. There's do's and don'ts for a quest. Uh, this quest has nothing but don'ts! Not worth it! Not worth it! White sword, also known as the wooden sword, is my level two sword. Yeah, I got it. And troll face. Yeah, grow up. <laughs> Fucking grow up. <laughs> you take that troll face shit elsewhere. <sighs> level two again. It's the freaky level. At one glance, it looks like a doggy or something like that. And it instantly kills you, too, if you touch it. Gotta love the fact that it instantly kills you if you hit you. I'm gonna get him trapped down here, then just keep hitting him. Wail on him! Good grief! How many hits does it take to kill that thing? Oh, that's great. Oh, so much for going around that way. Let's try it. Oh, there we go. Sixteen hits. That's absurd. I am missing a key or something, so I'll go back. Oh, hey, a map. <laughs> you sure you're not missing a zero somewhere over there? Because, um, um, um that's a lot of damage. <laughs> that's a lot of digits. <laughs> 10,000. So yeah, he's worse than a death bow. Okay! Great! I'm glad- it's pretty much instant death no matter which tunic you have. So four damage is- whoa! Four damage is one hard. Then... yeah, he's deadly. Well, I will say that I got a key. I will say that Joel McCool is kind of a lot more creative this time around. Uh, unfortunately, he uses all his creativity for all the wrong reasons. For sure. For damn sure he does. Huh. He's getting more creative by the second. Unfortunately, he's creative in all the wrong ways. <laughs> The door just relog itself. The door just relocked itself, didn't it? The fucking door just relocked itself behind me.
This could prove to be problematic. <laughs> Why is there a door down? What's a long right? Screw that. Where there are three Gibdos. I'm having trouble adjusting to the fact that the wooden sword is the wise sword. Alright, candle. Sweet. Well, this room isn't really that dark. Oh, so I'm off the map now. How nice. I guess this cabin really is crooked. If I go back up, no, I can't go back up there. Okay, good. He actually thought about that, did he? Can't go that way either. Dude, you need to work on your looping skills. Because you are quite loopy. Also, I has a loopy. Okay, got the big key. Let's finish this bloody level and get out of this place now. So that's apparently a custom torch. Oh great, you again. Three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, ten hits. It's all a whole damn lot. And what's to the left? Ow. Har, 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 he want this too bad. Oh, he's a different one, okay. Who wants some of this? Bonk. <sighs> oh, good grief, this game. Oh, God damn it! Diagonal walking should be considered an exploit and not required to do. Ever. Adam's castle? No, I have not found that yet. I have not at all found that place. So where I find the Adam's family? That doesn't sound right. Okay, do not kill anything here. Do not, I repeat, do not kill stuff here. It's a wild guard. <laughs> yes, let's have a Pokemon. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Fuck! <laughs> That's so random. Don't slash the grass. Oh, hey, it's Route 36. <laughs> Thank you for welcoming to read Route 36. Oh, hey, another Pokemon battle. What? I have to... I can't go this way, apparently? Or do I have to walk in a specific spot to avoid these guys? It's not there. There we go, got through it. I just entered Goldenrod City and died. Okay, so don't go off the path. The path is safe. The ground to the land to the left and right of it is deadly. By the way, if you like Pokemon Gold and Silver now, you're gonna hate this quest forever then. Just gonna say it now. <laughs> what the hell? Oh god! Oh. Gee, thanks for letting me know that now! Would have saved me from a few deaths by telling me. Route 25? What about Route 35 and 34 and everything else? And Oh, yeah, I need to, I need another key for that. I'll be back there shortly, though. I'm exploring the sights and sound of Goldenrod City. Oh, your troll to troll boots! Aren't you special? Alright, I'm getting out of here. Okay, abuse the red candles is all I'm gonna do for now because this is just bad. Kirby's territory. Oh dear. Randomizer much? Oh, now we're making fun of the randomizer. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's not make fun of something that's good. Oh, you are kidding me. I gotta walk through that wall, probably. Maybe. Oh, yeah, you better believe it. Randomizer is a lot better than this will ever be. Why do I keep switching to uh, bait? And why is there something invisible to kill me again? 
Oh dear. Okay, where's the walkthroughable block? There is no walkthroughable block, is there? I see what I must do now. Again, I can't get to Golden Ramon's gym because of the decaying path. Here we go. Okay, so that is a troll. Right into an invisible spike. Of course, why not? Right into a potentially unavoidable spike. Why does that exist? Again, why does this quest even exist? Doesn't matter if I need arrows, four heart spike right there. Bada bang, bada boom, bada dead. Okay, I need arrows. So let's go back to Kirby's territory. Okay, I don't know why I'm playing this now. Oh yeah, I got some shit. Yeah, I don't need to. Hold on a second, I got an idea. Bad idea, but it's a bad idea nonetheless. So what this quest is trying to do is bring various things and drag them through the mud. Yet, uh, this quest is dragging me through the mud, basically. My randomizer people are always obsessed with... It's not that good. Is that like... I could probably try to do that. What is that? Like a... Like an unlimited heart spike or something? I just went through a door. Okay, now this game is trying to ruin Kirby. And it's doing a pretty damn good job. 32 heart spikes! Oh, great! He's getting better! I think I just shot a bomb, didn't it? This is the fourth level. Great. 
doing stuff out of order like a boss. Looks like someone's had fun with the enemy editor. <laughs> Again, for all the wrong reasons. Oh hey, a normal blue was robe and I died by it. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting out of the Kirby Catacombs. Let's go to the actual level 3. Wand is not worth lots and lots of pain and suffering right now. Huh. Even though it would be most helpful, to be honest. No, I want to do level 3 first. Snow and green dark nuts. And yet again, an invisible spike floor right in front of the door. <laughs> oh, good God. There's a red bush down there. This is probably pointless as hell, but let's check it out real quick. It's just a red bush. There's nothing special. Okay, I'm going back to that. Let's just do level three. I need to find a key because I needed another one. Uh. Well, if you say Harkonnen, I say yes. Let's do it. I swear to god, if I get a comment from Joel McCool saying, You just wanted to open my quest out? That's not fair! You know what? Invisible spikes aren't fair either. You lose. <laughs> you lose so hard that you just lose. You, you just, just no hope for you. No hope for this quest either. Oh crap, wrong way. I love random blue dark nut encounters. They're so much fun. Ugh, I remember hugging this area, but I guess that's not the right way now. I got hit here just fine the first time. Maybe I need to use a half tire abuse thing, I guess. Hey, that's what it is. I think I hugged the wall a little too tight. Or not. Will I ever reach Golden Rod City again? Probably not. That doesn't work. I don't know why I thought it would work. One row from the right, alright. You are right indeed. There we go. Ah, 
help. <laughs> Okay, so this is a maze. Good. Wah! Wow, I'm a Mount Adam now. Oh, hey, it's a lock bush from earlier. Right, so I warped to the Adam's Castle. And I can't get that, obviously. Thank god he's stuck down there. Well, I already know what I'm getting here. That's why at least let me navigate the invisible spikes a bit more. Unless it uses health to jump, which would suck. Oh god! What the fuck did I just do?! That has got to be one of the dumbest moves I've done today. Oh god, if Evan's watching this later, he's gonna make some of me so hard later. <laughs> I can see it now! That was a critical fail on my part. Okay, I was afraid that jumping would use either, like, health or money or something. So, you like the Adam's Family? Well, you're not gonna like this quest, then. Wait, is this music Sonic music? I recognize this music. I know a certain someone that probably wouldn't want to hear that. Anyways, um, yeah. Do I want to know why? Oh, great. <laughs> Oh, thank you for landing on me. Whoa, hey, I'm in normal. That's a normal looking part of the level. The music break. No, it's not. Oh, this is this is that room. Are you sure about that now? Oh, Tommy's getting better at block puzzles because I really don't want to think that. Please, for the love of everything, don't tell me he's getting better at block puzzles now. I don't know what that block does. Okay, it moves to left or right, probably. Not important. <laughs> and I just jumped onto another spike. Go me! You jumped into a spike, you moron! You see it, I've already experienced it. <laughs> Believe me, I've already felt the stupidity already. Okay, stick to the outer lane. Okay. Okay. So, 32 heart spikes. 
Apparently these are new in 2.5 and unfortunately Joel McCool has learned to use them. That's not good for us. That is definitely not good for the rest of us. Thirty-two horse spikes. Unfortunately, Joel McCool has learned to use these. <laughs> All right, got there. Let me guess. There's a path that leads to that key that I have to guess by dying many, 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 many times just to get to. Oh, you can't get it at all, okay. Alright, let me scribble a note to myself. Ask Bagel or TS to try to get Link the Master to at a negative rating system to database. And... I'm trying this up. Okay, there we go. That's a reminder for me. Reminder. So, has this level, does this game suit below the Shamanok level? Oh, you bet it has. <laughs> it's in the asshole category now. I'm afraid of going anywhere else in this room now. I'm just deadly afraid of, you know, invisible spikes. Oh. Oh hey, it's a key hiding under blocks. The idea tube is ringing. What if I got lucky and got a clock? <laughs> oh, the chance of that happening though is quite very finite. So finite, it's probably not worth it. <laughs> That's not gonna happen, apparently. And I've got there four horse spikes in this room. Let's go straight up. It's a super dark nut. Oh. I don't know the drop table, so I can't say what they would or would not do. Oh boy. Not worth it.
Oh god, that was close. I beat the third level! Oh god. <laughs> right, I'm gonna need to F6 and hope I spawn somewhere different. Yes, I do. Good! Yes! Let's try one more thing! <laughs> oh god! Let's see if I can get into that place over there real quick now. Is there any way into that cave, or is there an alternate way I'm supposed to go? Because, what the fuck?! <laughs> Unless I can try to candle boost and then jump. Maybe curve all the way around in time to get inside the hole. But that's risky. Nope, I gotta do it right the other way. Okay, I think I can do this. Like, I'm pretty sure I can do this. Now, the question is, I don't know why I want to do this, but I'm pretty sure I can do this. There's not even a warp tile. It's just the cave that's there to troll you. Oh. Well. Let's head to Kirby Land real quick. Get the wand. I'll go to Golden Rod in a bit. I'll go back to the land of crushed Pokemon dreams later. Uh, this is not the right way. You might be going the wrong way. So that's a troll cave. SN, SN, oh, that's good to know. I just figured side cave entrance, like, uh, cast, cast it. Those kill you one hit, don't they? Great! Breaking news! Ow! Uh, oh. uh, uh, uh. 
Ugh. Hi, I don't want to know. I just don't want to know. I no longer want to know at all. I don't know why I'm still playing this too. But I am. trust these invisible spikes at all! And I'm dead. <laughs> One screen on the overworld has a... Are, are we talking about the overworld right outside this dungeon, or the overworld in general? I want to assume you're talking about this area out here. That doesn't kill you one hit. That's good to know. Might be this screen. Doesn't even work. I can't, on the other hand. So I'm walking in P now. Scream right at the dungeon entrance. That won't be this, would it? Yes, it is. Okay. get to this level for the day, and I'll be done for the day. <laughs> and we'll get to another 32 heart spike, because why not? I haven't done that enough today, no, not at all. I don't know why this has to be called the Kirby Catacombs and use Kirby music, but ARGH! Ow. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! like Bagel's spawner in a bad quest. Got the one though, so there's that. That's required to get rid of that. And I'm dead. Right into the four heart spot, 32 heart spike again. Oh, it's also a 32 heart spike. 
Are you sure these are 32 heart spikes? Because they could be 64 heart spikes. They could be 10,000 HP damage spikes. I don't know. But they're definitely more than 4 heart spikes, that's for sure. Oh, hey, Cicero. That's also a spike, too. Oh, okay. 32 heart spikes. Awesome. Yes, I need to kill everything in this room to go that way because I get the feeling I do. <sighs> Any normal person would be asking me right now, why the fuck am I still playing this? And you know what? I don't even know. I just am. I guess you could say I'm used to this kind of crap by now. Okay, so that's another truth. I gotta start memorizing where all the 32 heart spikes are in this quest, because I keep walking into them. Oh, this is level 5? Oh. I got a wand! <laughs> oh, let's be honest, nothing looks pleasant at this point. <laughs> Not your fault. Not your fault this quest is terrible. Not your fault I'm playing a terrible quest. My fault for playing this quest, actually. That's the map. Oh, I guess I need the ladder. That might be the problem. I think I've hit my limit today, though. <laughs> I've hit my limit. 56 deaths later, and I'm at my limit. <sighs> Alright. Ladder bow and silver arrow, which means I can get whatever's in that other level after that. I might pick this up and work on it tomorrow night. I don't know yet. All I can say right now is, I've hit my limit. I'm stopping. And I'm gonna go cry somewhere for... I, I don't know. I'm not, not really, but... Uh, <laughs> well... This is a quest! <laughs> yeah! Alright, now let's get done to stop the video. See you next time, etc. Goodbye.